Okay, so it's been about 10 minutes or so, 15 minutes, and the tote is done. The IBC tote is done. Um, we cut around the corners, cut all the corners off, and then folded this back in here. I'm going to run a couple of self tappers through this part down here just to hold this in place, and then these extra pieces at the bottom I'm going to cut off so that nobody gets hurt. And that's it. This is probably the easiest, quickest hack of any of them that I've seen. I know a lot of the ones I saw online kept the plastic liner down at the bottom of the tote. This one ha this tote has a solid metal bottom with nice perforations in it, so I'm just going to leave that as is. I do have the plastic tote if I change my mind later on and decide that that's what I want to do is to actually put that back in there because there's still too much waste going on the ground. Um, but otherwise, yeah, I'm done. This is it. I'm gonna cut these these spare pieces down here off Like I said I was gonna do and then um, and take it up to the girls and see what they think of it That's it. That's the feeder tote hack and the reason for this is hay feeders that are of this type are anywhere from a hundred to two hundred dollars and up um, for a small rack feeder like this and this IBC tote we bought I want to say three years ago for about less than fifty dollars and I know I can still find them all day long for that same price less than fifty bucks no problems so we're gonna hope this works well and if anybody has any questions or feedback um, you know how to get in touch with me